everybody, how you doing? I'm feeling great. It's really hot outside. For those of you who are going out or who's working under the sun, do remember to apply some sunblock and protect your skin. Today, I'm going to share with you a simple recipe on dessert, and that is called Onde Onde. Onde Onde is a very popular dessert dish among the Malays and the Chinese. So here, I'm going to show you my version of Onde Onde. My son has been asking me, Mommy, when can I come into your video? So today, I'm going to introduce you my son. Hi everyone! My name is Dadisat. How old are you? Five years old! Wow! So Mommy is going to make Onde Onde today. So later, when I finish, you come and see if it looks yummy. Can you do that? Can. All right, guys. We're gonna start cooking. Ta-da! My onde onde is ready. Here are the ingredients. You will need one cup of glutinous rice flour, one and a half tablespoon of plain flour. Quarter teaspoon salt, one cup shredded coconut, palm sugar, one and a half cup water, and crew pine leaves. We're going to clean the leaf, cut off anything like dried leaf that you can see here. For example, here, we don't want this dried leaf. Alright, so you can cut it off. Cut the screw pine leaf to smaller pieces. And we're going to put into our blender. And we're going to blend this screw pine leaf and make it to a juice. We want to have the green color from this leaf. So cut them small size so that it can blend evenly in the blender. Put in the two pine leaf into your blender. And add one and a half cup water. And blend it well. The crew pine juice is ready. We're going to drain out the juice and we're just going to use the water to make the dough for the onde onde. Let's drain out the crew pine juice. We're going to move on to prepare the palm sugar. And I'm going to take one piece of this and I'm going to pound it. Alright, it's quite hard actually. I've moved them to the floor. It's better to pound them on the floor. You just don't want to crack anything on your table or your counter. After you have cracked them, it will be a bit medium size. You're going to cut them into smaller pieces. Just nice to put into your onde onde. Don't worry about the size, okay, not too big, just like this will do. Don't worry that it's going to be cube, whether my sugar is going to, uh, going to be hard inside my onde onde. Don't worry about that. Once you cook it, the sugar will melt. Alright? So continue to do that for the rest of your palm sugar.
the palm sugar is cut well and the crew pine juice is also ready we're going to move on to make the dough for the onde onde add in the glutinous rice flour also the plain flour mix it well and we're going to add in the crew pine juice add them bit by bit mix it well and make it to a dough As you can see, the dough is ready. It is nice and it's not sticking to my finger. You can add one drop of green coloring and that will make the color nicer. I like to keep it natural and uh, this color is good for me. Next, we're going to prepare the shredded coconut. Here, I have the shredded coconut. I'm going to put them on a plate. Thread them a little bit and the salt. I have here quarter teaspoon of salt. Mix them well. And put them aside. I'm gonna move on to prepare the onde onde. Pinch a little bit. Get about a small piece and make it to a ball and that's about one and a half inch thickness. Make it to a ball. Press them in the center and add one piece of the palm sugar and close them. And make it to a ball again. After you have shaped it, it should give you about a ping pong size of a ball. And put them on a the plate. Here I have put a bit of a plain flour so that the dough doesn't stick to the plate. So put a bit of plain flour and the onde onde. Continue to do the rest of the, the dough. The onde onde has been shaped into a ball. Let's move on to boil the onde onde. Take a pot, fill it with water to a half level of the pot and wait till the water is boiled. The water is bring to boil. It's time to add in the onde onde. Add them one by one. As you can see, when you drop in the onde onde, it sinks to the bottom. But once it is cooked, it will start to float up. All the onde onde ball is in the water. Bring it to boil for about 8 to 10 minutes.
it been 8 minutes now I have boiled this under a medium fire and you can see all the onde onde ball is floating up it's time to remove them from the water Coop out the onde onde and wait for a while till all the water drip out and put them on a tray of the coconut of the shredded coconut coat the onde onde with the shredded coconut My onde onde is ready. Here, yeah, the onde onde looks so good. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna take one of it. Mm. It's so good. The sugar just melt in my mouth. It's very soft. The coconut tastes well and I'm just loving it. Welcome back Darren. Mommy has just finished making the onde onde. Does it look yummy? Yes, it's so yummy. Wow, thank you so much. So guys, thank you for watching. Do remember to click like and subscribe and follow my channel. Have a great day.